A new image of 3i Atlas came out this week, and it ended up looking a lot different from what most people thought it would. At first glance, it's just a clean, steady picture of a distant visitor moving through our system, but there's something about the overall look of it that makes you slow down and take a second look. Not because it's strange in a scary way, but because it feels more controlled and more polished than you expect when you hear the word comet. It has that smooth glow around the center, a tail that holds together better than usual, and a kind of calm shape that almost looks like it was drawn on purpose. 3 Eye Atlas has been moving across the sky for a while now, coming from who knows where, and every new image gives us a slightly different piece of the story. But this one stands out because it finally shows the object in a way we can actually see and understand without guessing too much. There's no wild blur, no broken streak, no messy cloud of light around it. Instead, the photo shows something neat, steady, and almost quiet, the kind of frame that makes you think about how far this object traveled just to show up like this. And maybe that's what makes this picture interesting. Not mystery, not fear, just the simple fact that 3 Eye Atlas looks clearer and more real here than in anything we've seen before. It's the kind of image that makes you want to look a little longer, not because something feels wrong, but because it finally feels like we're seeing the object for what it is. When people started sharing the new image of 3 Eye Atlas, the first thing that stood out wasn't anything dramatic. It was actually the opposite. The whole frame has this steady, organized look that you don't normally expect from something drifting in from another star. The picture came from a setup in New Mexico made by someone who just pointed a telescope at the sky and stacked a bunch of long exposure shots until the details finally came through. And the result doesn't look rushed or chaotic. It looks clean, almost calm, like 3 Eye Atlas decided to hold still for a moment so we could finally see it for real. The core sits there with a soft glow, not blown out, not messy, just clear enough to make you notice how smooth the transition is between the bright center and the faint haze around it. That haze is the coma, the cloud of gas and dust that wraps around the object as it heats up. And in this image, it looks surprisingly even almost like it's been shaped by a steady hand instead of by random bursts of sunlight. Then there's the tail, which stretches out in a way that feels neat instead of scattered, as if the whole thing is moving through space with this calm, steady rhythm that doesn't match the usual idea of a wild, icy rock flying past the sun. What makes the stillness interesting is that it doesn't look forced. It doesn't look artificial, it's just different from what most people expected after hearing all the talk around 3 Eye Atlas in the last weeks, usually these images come out blurry or stretched or covered in noise, and you end up guessing what's comet and what's artifact. But here, the structure is sharp enough to follow without squinting, which makes the whole thing feel a little more real and a little less like something we're trying to interpret through imperfect data. And maybe that's the part that makes this image stand out. It, it gives 3 Eye Atlas a shape that feels grounded, something you can point to and say, oh, okay, this is the object we've been talking about. It doesn't scream for attention, it doesn't try to look dramatic, it, it just exists there with this quiet clarity, almost like the silence in the picture is helping the object hold itself together in a way we haven't seen before. It's a calm frame, but not a boring one, because the more you follow the edges and the soft transitions, the more you start to understand why this single image got so many people talking. Even though the new image of 3 i Atlas looks calm and steady, a lot of people who have been watching this object every night noticed something interesting. The calm doesn't always match what they've been seeing in their own observations. The photo shows a clean core, a smooth coma, and a tail that stretches in one clear direction, but many amateur astronomers have been talking about little changes that don't always line up with that perfect still frame. Some of them mentioned that the coma seems to shift from night to night almost like the glow moves around the object instead of staying centered the way it usually does in most comets. 
There were also reports of brightness changing in short bursts, the kind of thing you don't expect unless the surface is releasing gas or dust in quick pulses. And in some time-lapse videos, the light around 3i Atlas looked stronger on one side and then stronger on another, something that made a few observers wonder if there was more happening under the surface than the image suggests. None of this points to anything dramatic, but it adds a layer of complexity that the calm picture doesn't show at first glance. The tail itself became part of the conversation because in some frames people noticed what looked like short jets that turned on and off, almost as if the object was reacting to sunlight in different ways as it rotated. And rotation might explain part of that since 3i Atlas seems to spin slowly, but even with that, the direction of the jets and the small color shifts in some images made the whole thing feel a little less predictable. Not strange enough to call it a mystery, but just different from the standard behavior people expected after seeing the clean, polished shot from New Mexico. All these details don't fight against the idea that 3i Atlas is a comet, but they do remind us that comets aren't simple. They react to sunlight, they release gas in uneven patches, they spin, they drift, and they change shape a little depending on the angle and the timing of the observation. But when you put the steady photo next to these small oddities reported by people watching night after night, you get this mix of calm and motion that makes the object feel more alive than a single image can show. And maybe that's the part that keeps drawing people back. The picture gives a clean snapshot, but the night-to-night -night behavior adds a kind of movement behind the scenes. It's not loud, it's not wild, it's just enough to make three. I Atlas feel like something that doesn't stay the same every time you look at it. And that contrast between the calm frame and the shifting details is what makes the entire conversation around this object feel so active right now. As more people looked at the new image of 3i Atlas, something interesting happened. The conversation split in two directions, almost like the object itself was giving two different stories depending on how you approached it. On one side, there's the clean photo, the one that shows a textbook comet shape with a bright center, a smooth coma, and a tail that stretches out in a neat line. On the other side, there's all the ongoing work from observers watching every night, catching little shifts in color, changes in brightness, and short bursts that don't always look the same from one evening to the next. And instead of fighting one another, the two versions just sit there, creating this space where both can be true at the same time. The new image feels like a moment where everything lined up just right, a frame where the distance, the timing, and the technique came together and gave us a clear look at what 3i Atlas can be when the sky cooperates. But that steady picture doesn't erase the fact that comets are messy and that 3i Atlas is still reacting to sunlight, still letting out jets here and there, still shifting in small ways that only show up when you follow it night after night. It's almost like the clean photo is one part of the story, and the rougher observations are another part, reminding us that even a calm object carries movement inside it. What brings all of this together now is the wait for the next set of images. Several spacecraft near Mars captured 3i Atlas when it passed by, and the one everyone keeps talking about is the shot taken by the high-rise camera, which can pick up details that no telescope on Earth can match. Those images haven't been released yet, and that gap between what we've seen and what's coming next adds a quiet kind of tension to everything. Not the dramatic kind, just the simple curiosity of wondering how the object will look when a camera far above us gets a clean angle with no atmosphere in the way. Maybe the image will look just like the one from New Mexico, smooth and steady and calm. Or maybe it will show the small details that people have been talking about from the ground, the things that flicker and shift from night to night. Either way, the next picture won't erase what we've seen. It will just add another piece to the long drift of 3i Atlas through our system, giving us one more look at something that doesn't change fast, but also doesn't stay fully still. And that's the part that makes this moment so interesting. We're standing right between what we know and what we're about to learn. 
not because the object is strange in a wild way, but because these different views help us understand how something from another star behaves when it passes through our neighborhood. It's a calm kind of curiosity, the kind that grows the more you see, and right now 3i Atlas is giving us plenty to look at. Even with all these new views and all the small changes people have been noticing, 3i Atlas still feels like one of those objects that says a lot without ever making a real sound. This latest image gave us the clearest picture so far, a calm frame that finally shows the shape we've been trying to see for weeks, but it didn't close the story the way some people hoped. If anything, it made the whole thing feel more open, because now we can see the clean structure in front of us while still knowing that the object keeps shifting in little ways every night. And that's the part that stays with you after the image leaves the screen. The idea that something can travel this far, drift through our system, pass by our cameras and still keep a few things to itself. Not in a dramatic way, not in a hidden way, just in a natural, quiet way that comes from being a visitor that doesn't belong to our star or our world. With the spacecraft images on the way, we're standing right before the next step, waiting to see how 3i Atlas looks from a place with no atmosphere and no blur. A place where the smallest details might show up with a sharpness we haven't had yet. And whatever those new pictures reveal, they'll add another piece to this slow, steady moment of watching something old and far and silent drift past us for a short time before it keeps going. If you want to keep following this story with us, wandering through these long distances and watching how small things change when the light hits them just right, leave a sign down below A, like a comment, a small trace of life so we know you're still here with us in the dark. And if you haven't yet, subscribe and stay close because this sky keeps moving and we're drifting through it together.